Tired of waiting to see the next episode reaction? Why not join the Patreon? You can gain access to reactions that have been uploaded weeks in advance before they land on YouTube. Most of all, you can watch the full-length versions without the annoying copyright filter and subpar audio for just $5 a month. If you want to take your loyalty even further, you can watch our non-animated related reactions as well as submit requests for just $10 a month. So stay ahead of the curve and help us sustain the brand. Thank, Thank you! you. Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy RVG, aka the Random Black Gamer, here with my lovely, horny wife, Janet Lee, on the ones and twos. And this is We Ain't Seen the Reactions, the place where we react to everything that we ain't ever seen. And if you read by the title, you already know it's time to jump into some more Black Clover, man, because last time we were thoroughly impressed with those couple of episodes that we saw, mainly the second episode, which, uh, what was that, episode 128? If I'm not mistaken, if I'm looking correctly, yeah, episode 128, we left off with uh, the Black Bulls fighting one of the henchmen of the Heart Kingdom. I forgot his name, but you know, he's already crossed paths with my girl. Uh, Hell, well, Mimosa. Mimosa, yeah, because. And got down Fenrir, and he thought he had it all together. He really did. And we learned that in the Heart Kingdom, they base their <clears throat> magic abilities off of like, I think it was level nine through zero, and zero was the highest, and that, yeah. other, that dude was supposed to be a zero, but right apparently he sucked because they blew his ass away yeah um and then asta end up fighting this the damn water spirit of the heart kingdom and trying to make his way to the queen to figure out what the hell they was trying to trap him for mm -hmm. yeah i don't know why man it's like being in this little world or this kingdom kind of puts me in the mind of the sky pr arc from one piece and especially with this guy who has like these lightning based abilities he kind of put me in the mind of the guy that was like the main boss baddie of that arc uh, i think his name was inaru i don't know if that's just me guys but you know all these different kind of elements like pertaining to water and them being in this kind of mystical kingdom kind of just gave me those vibes which is cool because i just love being in these territories that are just weird and unfamiliar you know especially to the characters they don't know what they're getting into so they're just as impressed as we are you know and this queen she wants to use asta's power i forgot for what reason i don't know it's like what what, what did she say that she needed his power for they needed his power for the uh for the kingdom's protection like there was a threat or something mm. that they needed his powers for or they yeah. needed him for Maybe it's to nullify any kind of magical attacks that will come up on yeah, the kingdom. Yeah, I wonder, and I'm like, bro, why didn't you just ask? You ain't got to kidnap people. Yeah, she trying to drown these niggas and shit. Like, she tried to cuff my boy in the water. Thankfully, you know, my girl, what's her name again? Mimosa? No, not Mimosa. No, what's the bird's name that oh, helped him? Uh, uh, Nero. Not, not, well, yeah, that's supposed to be the bird's name they call her that sometimes i mean they call her nero and then they call her what is her name sucre Sucre. yeah sacre or something like that Sec sacre or something yeah she came in and unsealed those little handcuffs for us yeah they tried it that was one of our favorite episodes yeah it was the animation was really good and the action was just great you know i was yeah. surprised but uh I, I checked the comments and you guys said that that was one of the more canonical episodes that's tied directly to the manga so hey it is what it is but hopefully the the creators or the showrunner of this show they do kind of give that same time and detail to some of the more fillerous episodes because we do enjoy those because they help connect the dots to stuff that wasn't really filled in with the manga you know we know we're getting this time skip pretty soon which i think is like a six month time skip mm -hmm. so it's going to be cool seeing how the filler that we watch connects to that but anyways guys we're not going to waste any more of your time we're going to go ahead and jump Let's into this The fuck? Who is that? What is you doing? Oh, that's that girl that was sitting there. The fuck? Surprise attack. <laughs> Did she set that nigga up for there? Oh, her glasses. Jinkies. Me. I was my breast set up like that. Mm. Hurry up and change out of your pajamas. Got one of them little water brawls. She can have one like that. So that girl's the queen of the heart kingdom? Queendom hearts. I only survived thanks to my defensive spell. Hmm. It appears she was holding back. What a great talent. As for the others. 
I like this character. Oh, wow. This nigga. He's so fast. Please forgive my rudeness. I forced you into a battle with me so that I could accurately judge your magic stages. Uh, magic stages? Is that the scale I Oh, y'all did that too. Or the smaller the number is, the more She's got a beaver pillow. Yes, your strength is judged by magic power, not the number of bows. For example, if there was one mage ranked very high on the scale, he might be victorious against dozens of lesser opponents at the same time. Can you guys tell us anything about devil curses? Always so direct. <laughs> Unfortunately for you, no one will ever talk about them. Actually, I happen to suffer from a devil curse myself. Of course. Ooh. If nothing's done about it, I'll be dead within a year or so. Aww. <gasps> that little Naruto seal. <laughs> Why? Why would you tell them that, fool? <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna talk to the queen like that. That adorable ignorance of yours will be the end of me one day. I just know it. What's wrong? Girl, you get on somewhere? I'm pretty sure we were in the middle of a life. Seriously. Got more important shit to tend to. The way their queen behaves, then I'm very concerned about them. Looking like a Dragon Tales character. That's what you can see everything. Yeah. Yeah. She got different chapters. She got filler arcs and canon arcs over here, man. watering the whole place at once she hmm. sees the entire kingdom at a glance and single-handedly controls the water thick ass glasses she got on <coughs> another one with thick ass glasses the living thing in her domain goes uncared for thick coat bottle glasses this magic is fitting for the queen of the heart kingdom now now laura pashka how about we change you into more appropriate attire you see our current ruler has inherited the ability of most of the queens who've gone before her She's our beautiful kingdom's guardian deity, the all-knowing priestess. Uh oh! We simply cannot lose someone as precious as her to a devil's curse. There Tight. is no one else like her. <laughs> okay, she got a little beauty under that. Princess diary looking at. That's better. See, that's what I look like when I take my glasses off. You know, beautiful. Mm, you look beautiful with them all. Oh, thank you. Oh, she's clumsy just like you! So oh my me, god! Um, this is you! Hey, I get it! The clumsiness must be part of the devil's curse too! Oh, oh girl, you got a devil curse on you? No, I rebuke that in the name of the Lord. Guys! Awesome. I'm so relieved that you're safe! You're the worst! Stop getting kidnapped! It's starting to get really old! Her Majesty the Queen. I can't help it if everybody won't me. <laughs> That's what I would say it. Faithful to the end. Don't do my song like that. She has you so majestic. And the friend. magic that she possesses is immeasurable. So that's the queen of the heart kingdom. Whoa, talk about a treat. Look at this simp ass nigga. How lucky am I to be in the presence of such an exception? Don't take nothing to make his missile go up. Stop it, Fenro. You're supposed to be better than that. You're a <laughs> He gonna be feeling some type of way ever since his brother t said what he said that last now time. Now you probably feel like he gotta prove him wrong. Nope. Residents of the Clover Kingdom, I humbly ask that you lend your strength to us. <laughs> Why she had the spirit with it? Now I didn't. I thought I was gonna trip over my wedding dress, y'all, but I didn't do it. Oh, a nosebleed. Oh, you're still adorable. <laughs> You see, spirit guardians are able to wield powerful magic by borrowing energy from natural mana, but they cannot defeat a devil. Unlike us, your kingdom created magic types that are not derived from nature. Mm. They chain, steel, and the eccentric spatial magic. In exchange, they lose the divine protection of natural mana. Uh oh! And some of the irregulars who were born in that environment have the necessary traits to best a devil. <laughs> One example of this is Julius Nova Prono, who possesses. Who doesn't look like this anymore? There is also the Black Bulls captain, Yami Sukuhiro, and his dark magic. Unfortunately, it appears the majority of Julius's power has been used up at this point. Oh, them pages gone. Big ass car filter. 
Them, right? <laughs> exactly. That's what it looks like. Oh, oh, what is that? Is that bigger than type zero or stage zero? I would like you to lend us your arcane powers to help us defeat that devil and the devil you fought with previously. Worse than him? We only won that time because we had help from super powerful people like the first wizard king and the leader of the elves. And even then it was a close call. Nagicula and I still had to finish him off. <laughs> what? But we barely stood a chance against that guy before. Sneaking like a Dragon Ball Z uh, yes, character. I remember dueling with that spirit guardian fellow in the past. He's extremely skilled. You guys fought? So, even someone the Wizard King speaks that highly of isn't able to defeat this devil? The way we are now, we can't win. We have to get stronger. Megicula is currently haunting the Spade Kingdom and using its citizens to gather up enormous amounts of power. Mm hmm. Soon, that devil could invade and conquer not only the Heart Kingdom, but Clover and Diamond as well. If nothing changes, then I will eventually be killed by this curse. That's why I'd like to invade the Spade Kingdom before my power becomes too weak. We can take half a year. Let's make our forces as strong as we can. Oh, she just said half a year. We should enlist any mages who stand a chance in battle against a devil. Train for six months. Then we will fight together to stop Magicula. If you help us, we will do it. Now the last time they tried to create a task force, half of their ass turned evil. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> so I don't know about this one, y'all. I don't know either. I'm certain you approve of this. Remember, the magic knights are still exhausted from fighting the elves. It's true that we have half a year, but this is a devil. Assemble all of the Magic Knight Squad captains. Sir. We'll be able to take this nigga serious looking like a walking plushie. No, no, no. Assemble all the Magic Knight exactly captains. Yummy gonna make us wait. That man is on the toilet. To make here. <laughs> Keep your voice down, you little shrimp. We all know that the captain can't do his business if he doesn't have peace and quiet. Man, I'm with you, man. Oh, shit. shit. Wait a minute, don't tell me you've been in there. Must have been all that whey protein, you. man. The war's not over yet. Trust me, I'd love to kick back and celebrate today's victory, but the next battle's already starting to rear its ugly. I want to know what he be eating. That's what I'm saying, man. <laughs> your visit to the heart. Man, your toilet ought to have a restraining order you on you right now, man. I'm not sure where to begin. Get this! We found out who was cursed by a devil over there, and it's the queen of all people. Pretty crazy, right? And if the curse isn't broken soon, then she's only got a year to live. Since she was chosen by one of the four great spirits, she's the most powerful mage they've got. If they lose someone like that, they're in big trouble. They are. So I'm pretty sure we're going to see other big spirits. I hope you at least got a little bit of use. I think we already saw the what's name in it. The Salamander Spirit. Yeah, I was going to say. So this one was more humanoid. In the Spade Kingdom. In Spade? If that's really true, then what we saw makes a lot of sense. Uh-huh. Did you guys find something weird? Apparently, when they went to check out the Diamond Kingdom, they ran into one of Spade's mages close to the border. Whoa, really? Except he wasn't just a normal mage. There were hundreds of Diamond soldiers on the ground. He Man, that's double jam, bro. Nothing. And that cold, dark magic he had. I wouldn't be surprised if he got it from a devil. Well, Spade, little emblem, look cool. It do. That nigga whole attire look clean. Right? You like a pimp. Without even realizing it. Oh no! If that's him, then the Diamond Kingdom is pretty much done for. All because of that one. Maleficent nephew. The Mars. Oh, I need to go, bro. That distance, one thing was obvious. <laughs> this man could have easily killed us. If we had picked to fight with him, we'd have suffered the same fate as those Diamond soldiers. Yeah, you're not tough enough yet. If we can't defeat that devil, then both the Heart Kingdom and the Clover Kingdom are going to be history. So the only solution is to try to get stronger. 
Queen told us to spend six months training. And after that, the Heart Kingdom will launch their attack on the Spade Kingdom. As Magic Knights, it's our job to spend every minute of the next six months getting as powerful as we can. And then we'll be able to help them defeat Magicula and keep everybody safe! One thing... What is it, Sora? Just so we're clear, are you sure training is all we have to do? Because beating a devil is hard even for the best of us. Unless we're stage one mages or higher, we won't even be able to keep up. To put that into so basically they're going to have to do a lot of training. Yeah, they're going to go back to the hot bottle time chamber with this shit. No, even that wouldn't be good enough in this situation. Wait a minute. Are you telling us we have to get up to a vice captain's level in just six months? <laughs> Easier said than oh yeah, that six month time skill. Yeah, they keep <laughs> mentioning it, so it's pretty apparent. Or mages whose power lands them in the arcane stage, including Asta, Nero, Captain Yami, and the Wizard King. Well, whether I have what it takes or not, I refuse to give up. We can all get there eventually, right? I have to. Magicula is the one who killed my mother. Hear that? Put your big boy pants on. The royal just said Boy, it must really be something because I ain't never seen him afraid to fight. I don't know, it's gonna send something sinister within that motherfucker. That wasn't like me, huh? After all, our friend's life is on the line, so I can't afford to give in to fear. You can't. Wait, what friend is this now? I'll do everything in my power to make myself a stage one mage. That way I can look out for my best. I really wanna see him show up. I wanna see all these niggas shine, man. I guess there's no choice then. No self-respecting magic knight would let a devil run wild and do whatever it wants, right? All right, Perry. I'm in. I have no idea what I can do to help out, but I'll try my hardest. I'll use these six months to make myself an even more powerful mage and get rid of that terrible curse. Maybe then I'll be worthy of Lady Finnis's heart. Maybe. After we stop Magicula and the curse has been broken, I want to talk to Nozelle again. About our mother. All that matters right now is beating that devil. And then maybe I can understand a little more about my own devil, too. For the sake of their right, this nigga don't really be looking at the scriptures up in this grimoire like that. Everybody else look like they use their shit. <clears throat> okay, for the next he just get the damn sword out of it. Yeah. Which means you can do what you want. So you get to go wherever, team up with whoever. He was looking dank. He was super dank. Remember, this is the devil in the space. Awkwardly buff. Train like your life depends on it. Because I'm going to kill you if you don't. We're here. Now, I usually tell you to do this in the heat of a battle. So six months should be plenty of time. Push past your limits, Black Bull. Plus Ultra. Right. That's right. But anyways, guys. <laughs> <laughs> that was episode 129, man. You know what I'm saying? A lot of exposition, but it was still exciting because we got a little glimpse of this guy. Uh, what was his name? Makula or something like that? Uh, Magicula. Magilla Gorilla. Yeah, Magicula. Magilla Killer. Magilla Cuddy. <laughs> Magilla Cuddy, yeah. Yeah, that dude, like, he means business, man. He pretty much wiped we out half of the Diamond his Kingdom. Face yet, and he looked like he ain't finna play no games. You know when a nigga. Just have his back turned and he kind of just turned to the side right there where you can barely see his face. He mean business. That nigga taking you out. So he, he, to the side. he probably detected what's the name them over there. He probably was just like, man, they ain't even worth my time. Man, it's like, y'all ain't gonna be worth my time until like episode 170. Y'all come see me after that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that dude, he like, he gonna mean business, man. And seeing how these, all the black bulls are gonna have to just level themselves up to captain status. I can't wait to see all the crazy abilities that they're going to pull off because that's one thing that I've been waiting for. You know what I'm saying? I know they get leveled up every now and then, but a good time skip art, that is going to make yeah. all the difference, man. It's going to be just like One Piece when they came back, you know what I'm saying, from that, uh, what was that? The, I don't know. I think it was the Navy arc or something like that or the Conviction arc. And everybody was strong. Luffy came back strong, and even Usopp and everybody. I want to see something like that. What the appearance has changed? Cause you know, I think gonna be buff and shit like that. I'm pretty sure everybody else gonna have a little different Hopefully look to him. Hopefully, he gets taller. That nigga ain't gonna be tall. He's gonna be short and swole. He gonna look like Stewie when he had got all built and shit. And he kept on messing with Brian. Oop, are you gonna write that? Oop, 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 sorry. It's gonna be the same way. I ain't never seen that, but I assume that it's a really thing hurt. of nightmares and hilariousness. But yeah, man, um, I can't wait to see that. You know, it's gonna be tough dealing with this guy. 
and hopefully we run across some more humanoid spirits because I think we've seen other uh, spirits like the salamander which Fuegolian has but to see an actual humanoid spirit well we got the wind spirit the we wind. got a wind spirit we got a fire spirit we, we got, got a water, water spirit, spirit so we just need an earth spirit yeah earth spirit yeah I wonder what that's gonna look like but uh, yeah, if I were to give that a grade, I'll give it an A plus. Yeah, I give it an A plus. Yeah, that was cool. You know, I can't wait to see these training montages and all the activities right? they're gonna be doing. We got Which a brand is new probably opening. Probably what all these episodes are gonna be between here and one fifty something. Pretty much, I'm pretty sure they're gonna be all over the place. Yeah. Yeah. But it'll be great to see the process. Yeah. So what did you give it? A plus. A plus. There you have it, guys. Two A pluses. We're gonna go ahead and move it on. Keep it moving with one uh, episode one thirty. So. Let's get it. As proof that this ruthless enemy is no longer a threat, the residents have gathered in the square, knowing that the stalwart individuals who watch over their nation are working tirelessly to restore peace and normalcy as soon as possible. Captain Hell no, nah, don't yay that nigga. No, right. no boo his This ass. nigga almost murdered all y'all. Throw rocks at him. All of these people, well, besides my boy Fuego. Yay him. That's the only one. And no Zell. Him? Yeah, he was he was good. Throw rocks at Charlotte ass. I don't see Yami or the Green They either over there fighting or Yami is on the toilet. Uh is he okay? That wonderful girl. Ah, Dragon Fist. Oh, he got a crush on her. Is she the one? <laughs> no, I got a crush on her. Who? Wow, hey. That ain't him. <laughs> they got the doctor up in this shit. Y'all couldn't bleach his hair or give him a wig. Why y'all gotta put on a front like this? Yeah, I just should have showed the God, Yeah, this feels fillerish. But it's alright. So his hair turned gray and his eyes turned green. That's ridiculous. Perhaps. But I can't exactly go marching into the capital looking like a child. There'd be trouble if the king saw me this way. Wizard King has a sore throat today, so sadly he won't be able to speak to you all. Please excuse him. Oh, I was looking forward to hearing... This is all he's gonna do. Things happen. Yeah. Look at my boy over there. Now, I'd like everyone to give a round of applause uh, to the young here. <coughs> she looked mad. ...and protected our beloved kingdom. Wouldn't be right. Our illustrious ruler... Augustus Kim of Clover the Thirteenth. Ah. <laughs> oh, hey, he's here too. <laughs> no applause. Why are you dawdling back there? Pick up the pace, knave. This is my one moment of glory, you know. So hard. How the heck did I end up being errand boy to this kid? Being a bootleg. Not going with the flow is for chunks. How dare you stand in my way? <laughs> <laughs> I want that wizard, I mean, that, uh, the damn, uh, Clover King to go somewhere. Caligula, uh, Magicula need to get his ass. <laughs> As you can see, the public awaits your kingly. I don't nobody care about what you got to say, nigga. Let's go. But please make it as brief as possible. Let Damn. The suspense kill them. Uh, oh, it's bad when Von just got to tell you. I beg your pardon. The king takes orders from no one. Man, look at your doo doo smudge face. Thanks to my brave deeds with minimal assistance from the magic knights, the eye of the midnight sun has fled, and peace has finally been restored to the Clover Kingdom. You're so welcome. None of this would have been possible without the impressive things I do on a daily basis. However, like I sitting in bed with two women <laughs> who don't want you. What if another enemy oh, my nigga Greg and Chris. I promise there's no need for that. And so, my adoring public, as long as the Clover Kingdom remains in my capable hands, it shall always be safe. Lay all your cares and doubts upon my shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? 
Oh, these what niggas. I, I had a feeling. Come on, bro. You don't have to ask me twice. Time to put your money where your mouth is for. Y'all didn't fight alongside each other long enough What's to be cool. What is this, a party? All right. Let's I know I told you to. We had an important event planned today. Violent? You saw the paper, right? They say one of the black bulls is possessed by a devil. He so is. When they he ain't possessed, the though. I knew they must have had outside help. Exactly. Oh my god, really? They're the worst squad. Why, you irreverent and great. Bitch ass movie. How dare you intrude upon my invincible light magic spell? Must have been invincible. Don't test me! You brute step right into I my I ain't got no but a toy for a spell. Perhaps this is a chance to show the people your leniency. If they see how merciful you are, they'll like you more. Oh, is that so? Who wants your opinion? Just because you've been hailed as a hero, give me a break! How his ass been hailed as a hero? <laughs> Seriously, this nigga allowed his other half to cause chaos. By all means, gentlemen, keep me in your raucous selves. It's a symbol of your passion for our great land. Sure. And now his majesty will take his leave. Let's give him one more round of applause. <laughs> Um, excuse me, Captain Jack. Look, anytime you want me to come back to the praying mantises, just give me a holler. Come back? Who the hell are you? <laughs> Part from me, for I know you not. <laughs> I should apologize, Yami. You and the Black Bulls are the ones who deserve that praise. Okay, I thought I was crazy. Mostly cheer for me. What kind of used to get? I had to check that. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So I was like, you know. Calm it was supposed to be a heart, heart a diamond, a spade, and a club. I was like, where's the club? The club is the closer. I thought she knew that. I just noticed that something was off, y'all. Perfectly all right. Listen. If you need to take a dump, it's not healthy to hold it in. Oh, my God. You did. Dead wrong. You really don't get it, do you, Yami? No wonder everyone's calling you a clueless idiot. She needs to piss. No! Wow. You're in charge. I can look at all the time. Jeez, look at them. I wish this was shocking to me. Forcing us to come to a meeting. Me trying to give you the love and affection you deserve, and you guessing something completely wrong. I bet you anything he forgot about all this. He's probably off goofing around somewhere like a little idiot. Crazy old man. Him again? Mm -mm. Not they asked him to Damn Natio is what I'm gonna call his ass. Careful. You gotta have his little balance scale, I see. One of my squad members again. I swear I will. Yami, I'm the one who summoned him here, so there's no need to fight. Wait, you were invited? So it would seem. Apparently the topic in question involves me. I was informed that my presence was required. Hmm. Our meeting today is about the devil residing in the Spade Kingdom. Recently, some of our magic knights paid a visit to the Heart Kingdom, hoping to gather information about the devils. I trust everyone's seen the reports by now. However, since you all were there, we would like to hear it from you. Please proceed. Okay. We'll do our best, sir. In the Heart Kingdom, the strength of a mage is normally determined by a system called the Magic Spade. Oh, the projector hands. The ranking starts at nine, then eight, seven. We'll page so wave. On. And the smaller the number, the stronger the mage. According to Queen Laura Pechka, it's extremely rare and favorable to have mages at stage zero. So whenever there's a battle, the side with the most warriors at that level is considered the superior one. Asta and his companions traveled to the Heart Kingdom to investigate a curse that was cast by a devil. We found that the victim was the queen herself. Apparently, she only has a year left to live. And the devil who cursed her was. Magicula. Yes. Some of the other Black Bulls also made a report. It seems the Diamond Kingdom is currently under attack by the Spade Kingdom. You can tell you go the Black Dude first. That's what I was thinking. I just didn't want to say it. It's likely that they could be you know they receiving kill assistance from the very people <laughs> we're discussing, right? So to so ain't nobody gonna be blacker than me. So we can decide the best Got a heart blacker than Don Cheeto, nigga. Ain't nobody gonna be blacker than my son. Laura Petra Ooh, plans to it. invade the Spade Kingdom in six months' time before she becomes too weak. We're considering deploying our own forces to fight alongside them. I'm asking each one of you to make sure your squads are as strong as you can. I'll participate in the battle. 
However, as you all know, the things I did in the past were unforgivable. And Beat I his ass. I'm no longer <laughs> worthy of facing my squad as captain. And so, with a heavy heart, I request that you relieve me of my position. Huh? Please relieve him. Wait. If you would, sir, I'd like you to assign me a new mission. It would be an honor to put my life on the line to help overthrow this devil. Captain Vengeance. If he's to blame in this, then so am I. Although my body was possessed by an elf at the time, I have committed unspeakable crimes. I should be put to death. I failed as well. It isn't right to call myself a captain. Mm, I don't feel all that bad about it, actually. Oh, well, you should. <laughs> all right, I've heard enough. I mean, just because you were sleeping, huh? I understand huh? why some of you may be feeling ashamed of what happened. That being said, I cannot and will not take away your responsibilities as captains. If I did, I'd have to extend the same treatment to the other magic knights who fell under control of the elves. There's too many people to punish. <laughs> so he like, um, just go sit down somewhere. Without them, we hardly have anyone left to guard our land. If you truly want to atone for your actions, yeah, the only one I'm looking at sideways is fucking Vonjus because he was be he was before the elf turn. He was, you know what I'm trying to say. Yeah, this nigga is he was aware. aware. As your command, Roger that. Doodoo head, nigga. Wonder how long so, his spell is. Does he have like a certain time clock or deadline if something's gonna happen to him? As we established, the magic knights need to train for the next six months in order to be successful in their battle against the devil. This dude. Hey, it's a hand lock again. Yeah. It is what he looks like. You're familiar with Gildair Poizat, the former captain of the Purple Orcas. He was recently caught in a crime, robbing the Shadow Palace. You know, to cast a vote to see if he can help them. Who was once his superior managed to get away with an enormous haul of precious gems and ancient magic items. Scum. Honestly, when will you ever learn? I can't wait any longer. I'm going to slice this ham into little bite-sized pieces. Slice his ass. I'd be doing the kingdom a service, I hate thievery. Right. right. Slice some bacon off his back. Because I've been thinking I might like to pardon Gildare instead. Man, are y'all desperate for fucking wizard right, captains? Right, Kingdom must not really be that scroll. I believe he's capable of turning an impressive profit by selling the very treasures that he attempted to purloin. He may have an offer he couldn't refuse. He's pushy like Yanni, but way stinkier. You better make sure you fetch us a good price at the market, little piggy. That's right, because if you screw this up, you're going straight to the chopping block. There's just one more thing. As I explained to you all a few moments ago, we do have certain limitations when it comes to our finances. Therefore, in order to alleviate the financial burden caused by our situation, I'll need to reduce your pay by 50%. What is that? I can accept that. It's I'd be looking the same way. She. No sweat. It's no problem at all. That's the least that I could do. Everybody who turned uh, into a damn elf everything. was perfectly oh, fine with that, so but everybody else was like, um something wrong come on man i'm in debt you can't just cut my pay do you want us to go yeah he isn't dead remember your subordinates are he be going to the damn gambling hall gambling mm -hmm. his clothes off this is my example well we decide these things based on maturity so reduce pay it is man y'all ain't know what's me oh push over look at all that destruction y'all done cost exactly that should just come out of their paycheck though that should right You can just pound us on them down, eh? How long do you plan to act like drunken fools? I can't you know you want her to be a drunken fool all of you. Man, mm -hmm. We can't expect you to care. Yeah, you know, because you're rich anyway. You probably won't even notice the difference when you lose half your pay. Uh, ah! This is nonsense. I wish you'd learn to drink in moderation. Bye. Bye. I bet your golden guests can stick around. Yeah, you got time. <laughs> Man, I'd be scared to hang around with Jack the Ripper while he drunk right there. We'll get our salary back by making you gambling away. Fine, I'll Nigga, don't. Y'all suck. They ain't gonna have no clothes on. You already know. This nigga. Typical. I want to get I got three times my face. I'm truly grateful to both of you. Despite what happened, you haven't treated me the least bit differently. Well, I'd have been looking upside his head like he didn't have no sense. I'm sorry. Mm. 
Get the fuck out! I think I'm like going to beat him in the back of the head with a pot, mm -hmm. but I can't because if we had if if the elf arc hadn't happened. Yeah, but guys, that was episode 130, a slower episode, but I guess just them kind of doing a little bit of reconnaissance, regrouping to figure out how they're going to go about fixing the kingdom and stuff. It's going to be a lot of budget cuts. Like this animation is probably going to be for the next few episodes. But hey, man, I'm here for it. I ain't tripping. It is what it is, man. Um, I don't know what else to say about that other than the fact that, you know, it's just is They finna it get is. it all together, man. They done got the task force together, you know. Uh, tree of the damn nights was all like, hey man, I don't even deserve my post no more. Reassign me. And he was like, no, no, it'll be all right. Now, the only person who I feel like should probably be reassigned was Vonjits, but you know, whatever. Maybe he didn't know how bad it was going to get. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I feel like they're giving him way too much leeway because right. nigga, you, you were self-aware at least. Everybody else was like fully under control. You actually right. gave this nigga leeway to do what he wanted to do. You even discussed it with him. He told you in advance what his plan was and you was like oh i understand i'm gonna let you kill my master get out of here with that bullshit bruh that's why you, you even know that it was messed up what you did yeah uh, that's the only thing i'm looking like um no seriously but, you know, maybe i don't even know maybe it's all about forgiveness i mean i understand it's all about forgiveness it's just a little weird man it's like this nigga know what he did but it is what it is. It's, it's weird for everybody that was an elf, and all of them seem to be feeling a bit guilty about that whole situation since it was their bodies being used to cause all that collateral damage. So, hey, what can you do? Everybody's kind of in the same predicament with Captain Yami and fucking Jack the Ripper. Like, they just broke. They're not trying to have it. They ain't. You know what I'm saying? The nigga Yami got bills you got to pay. You got mouths to feed and stuff. So, it is what it is, man. But. Yeah, if I were to rate those, I ain't gonna lie, I'd probably give them a B plus. Or rate that one. I'd yeah, give, I'd give it a B plus. Yeah, it was just kind of like so, 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 so. Yeah, but guys, I know you guys probably want us to skip ahead, but I think this is the best way to go about doing it because for one, it doesn't really take us a lot of time to get to brand yeah, new episodes. Yeah, we'll probably be at 150 something in no time. Probably yeah. a week or so, two, three, seven. Yeah, it's best that we just front load it with as much content as possible because if we skim through a handful of episodes, we'll probably be done with the series in no time. So it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? So bear with us. If you guys don't want to watch those episodes, then hey, be my guest, skip out and just wait till we get to what episode 151 or 150 as you guys suggested just you know chill with us and while you guys are doing that maybe you can give us some recommendations on other animes you want to watch because black clover ain't gonna be here forever uh, especially if they ain't gonna turn out another season anytime soon so yeah let us know if you want us to react to anything else like later on or something especially you tier two uh, tier three uh patrons out there you guys get first priority so yeah Definitely let us know what you want us to react to. But I guess that's all we have to say to you mofos. But if you got anything to say to us, just leave it in the comment section below. And we will get back to you briefly. But this is your boy RBG, a.k.a. The Random Black Gamer. Here with my lovely wife, Jenna Lee, on the ones and twos. We'll catch you guys later on the next reaction to Black Clover. Peace.